Wow. That thing is crazy. This rings a beauty. Look at these rolls. My God. You don't see that every day. Oh, you don't see that every day. Wow. What's up, guys? This is Ashnox, and I'm going to be summoning for Bomb Model Kana on my third account on the Europe server. So, I have a lot of plans for this hero. I want to try her out in PvE and in PvP. And, uh, well, let's start by summoning her, right? So, in this video, it's going to be the summoning, and uh, I'll uh, bring her to plus 15 skill ups. And I'll be talking uh, about some stuff about this hero, right? So, of course, you can get her for free from the connection, guys. Don't just start summoning for this hero. It's just I didn't push the story, so that's why I'm doing this, right? And artifact, maybe. Is it going to be uh, her artifact or another one? Snow Crystal? Okay, well, I didn't have that. And I uh, can't complain when you get uh, some 5-star stuff, especially early on. I'm getting some gold shine as well. That, that, that was uh, that, That's a pretty solid pull. To be honest, like, I was pulling for... Um, in the Guilty Gear collaboration. Man, I... Yo, I can't skip this. I've done, like, over 50 pulls and it... it <laughs> another artifact. I just kept on getting 3-star artifacts and heroes. That was ridiculous. Okay, here we go. I got her artifact. My god, that's... That's good. And... Wait, I... Okay, I can't skip that. Okay. I mean, yeah, complain is going good so far. You should definitely be saving your currency though for limited heroes. We got the collaboration coming up in June as well. So, you know, with uh, the fact that she attacks two targets, the speed damage multiplier, and the fact that she gets 15% speed from her passive, grand speed buff for the whole team, plus attack buff for herself, like very like self. Uh, sufficient hero and uh, man that, that's a nice pull here not definitely not bad that's a hero that you can just support in pve content i'll definitely be trying her out in as a mana hunt i'll be trying her out you know in, in all sorts of uh, places and i i really can't wait to see what kind of number she's able to uh, to do right like in, in expedition earth expedition other expeditions hell raid i'm really curious about her performance uh, in hell raid Th that's the type of pull i was getting during the guilt to gear collaboration off recording because i didn't record the uh pulls for my fourth account after the the, the initial summoning video look at that like it was constantly these things i was just doing secret shop refreshes after i'm done i get 50 covenant bookmarks boom I i'm uh yeah they, they just uh, show me a bunch of three stars on the screen not even any animation on the screen of any no gold shine oh yeah man it's it's terrible when that happens and i i know i know it happened to a lot of you guys it's definitely rough that's why you should always have uh, currencies saved up for you know limited banners and it doesn't mean that you know you got lucky in the past or maybe you got like a bad luck streak for a while and that your luck is gonna turn at this exact moment like it, you can get a dry streak for a long time and you just gotta get used to it uh, okay, let's continue. Um, at least I'm getting some gold shine, so... And I, I got two 5-star artifacts. So, to be honest, like, it's actually pretty solid. I got her artifact as well. Um, yeah, I mean, in PvE content, I'll probably stick a Daydream Joker on her, or... Well, I'm not sure exactly which artifact I'll be using outside of that for PvE content. Uh, you know, got some gold shine here, not bad. For PvP, well, I might just go for as much damage as possible, right? Uh, I don't need to worry about dual attack chance with, uh, from Rosa Hargana because she already has 15% from her, her passive up to 20% with uh, the base dual attack chance. So, man, okay. Yeah, dual attack, atta dual attack chance is very, very nice there. I can't skip this. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, the, the skill one attacking two target... Rod of Amaryllis. Now, that's a really powerful one. And you should have multiple copies of that. Like, you would not limit break into one. Like, you want... If you get two or three, don't start limit breaking. Like, keep two, three separate ones because it's that powerful and you don't get that much value when you just uh, start to limit break. So, this applies to multiple artifacts in the game, actually. Okay, so that's, that's it. Maybe I actually end up getting her before... Uh, the pity. Uh, so, 
Okay, there she is. Wasn't that early on? Or maybe that's really the last summon in the the X10. Bomb model Ka uh, Kana. And... Uh, yeah. I feel good about this hero. Especially the fact that she's free. Everyone has access to this hero. It's... It's a hero that... Can be used more than Yuna. That's the thing. Wait a second. I got her earlier on. I actually got her before I didn't even join the 121 club. Be, be, yeah, that's it. Oh my god, look at this shining here. That's that's a crazy uh, pull. It's not a bunch of 5 stars, but still, it's pretty solid. Look at that, Clarissa and Karen there. Moonlight, like these artifacts are very good. Kill 3 plus 3. Passive plus 3. And then you max skill 1. Then you max passive, the skill two, and you finish with maxing skill number three. Uh, so I mean, I'll just do that, and then I'll just max her out. So I feel like that's the better way to do it because you're just gonna be spamming skill one most of the time, and uh, really skill three doesn't hit that hard. The skill one hits quite hard, two targets, and of course, like this, this is some juicy stats right there. You know, like. The speed and the dual attack chance increase. That that's a big deal. Definitely is. So that that's how I would do it. Definitely. And I, I like that you get the the effect chance before the minus one turn. Very uh well investment. Uh, you know, initially you can definitely uh, get this hero going without uh, breaking the bank. So that's cool. I can't believe that I only got three three star penguins after. Usually like 10, over 10,000 uh, stigma. That's crazy. Okay, so she's uh, 6 star max level. Let me awaken her real quick here. Oh, I got my chest. Yo. Effectiveness, but still. Th this is really good. I wonder how good it's going to roll. My god. Okay. Oh. With that weapon. I'm gonna roll that and see. Maybe I use it on her. Hopefully it doesn't roll too much in uh, effectiveness. That's not bad. Maybe it rolls well. A nice rolls on that. Ooh. Yo, this chess. Okay. Wow. That thing is crazy. This rings a beauty. Look at these rolls. My god, you don't see that every day. Oh, you don't see that every day. Wow. Not bad. I mean, if it rolls well and it dodges the flat attack, even if you end up getting you rolls in flat, it's not so bad. You see how many I have of those, man? I've been hoarding so many things on this account. It's crazy. Oh, that's a great necklace. Man, even the flat attacks there. That's crazy. Hope it rolls well. Oh. No attack percentage, but... Yo, that's some nice values. Nice substats. After having done equipment conversion on... Probably over a hundred pieces because I had a lot of material saved up. The ones that I'm going to enhance and I feel like have pretty good potential for Kana, right? There's this chest which looks insane. Hopefully not too many rolls into effectiveness. And there's this helm. Hopefully it dodges the flat defense. This weapon, hopefully it dodges the, attack, uh, the effectiveness but it's okay like if I get some high rolls I'll be happy this chest has some potential of course this ring is completely insane it's just plus two guys this thing is crazy after over like a hundred equipment conversion I can't wait to see how this ring is gonna pan out because this thing is like perfect wow got these boots crit crit damage maybe it rolls well and another pair of boots and yeah, there's this one, attack uh, and uh, crit damage. Now this necklace with uh, crit, attack, speed, flat attack, that, that could be insane. 
Could be insane. Another neck here. I mean, we'll see. We'll see how they roll. Okay, 8548. Ooh, four speed. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Eight. That's a 5% crit chance. Very good so far. Okay, uh, effectiveness 4%? Oh, man. Okay, let, let's, let's bring it all the way to plus 15. And let's see what happens. 13, 5, 8, 12. Come on. Okay, I mean, 4% crit damage. Uh, it could have been better. We'll see, we'll see. I might, I probably have something better than this. Didn't work out too well near, near the end, though. 4, 12, 5. Okay, I mean, dodge is the flat defense. That's pretty solid. 4, 12, 11. Oh, God, I'm gonna stop here. Yeah, definitely stopping there. Come on, man. 8, 8, 7, 7. Oh, uh, 5% crit damage. Now, do we get... Oh, man. Oh, no, that's good. 4% crit chance. That is good. I'm going to bring that up. Let's see what 12 gives. 8, 8, 11, 12. Uh, this one. Come on. Okay, 6% crit damage. Nice. Do I bring that up? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Like 7 points after reforging. Could be a perfect roll now. And then after reforging, that's some really good value actually. No speed, but still very powerful stuff. 8, 8, 11, 18. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, 8, 8, 11, 18. Oh, look at that. 70% attack. Nice. Very good weapon right here. Let me, Let me enhance this chest. Let's see if it can redeem itself. Crit, crit damage and speed. Or 3% crit. Ugh. Let's see a plus 9. I might give up at plus 9. 2, 7, 11, 6. Ah, 2 speed. Uh, forget it. Got better than that. It's not worth it. Okay. This rig, guys. This rig is insane. Let's see what it rolls. It's plus two. No roll so far. Four, five, eight, six. Oh, perfect crit. Perfect crit, baby. Let's go. Come on. Come on. I don't even know. What was that? 6% crit damage, I think. I think it was at 6% before. Oh, God. 4, 10, 8, 12. Oh, perfect crit damage. This ring is insane! Come on, please continue. Oh, perfect crit! That was 10. That was 10% crit chance before. 5%! Wow! This could be one of my best rings so far. Okay. The speed is uh has not been rolled, but it's okay. Because it could be one speed, you know. 4, 15, 8, 19. Oh, perfect crit chance! Yo, this thing's a beast! This thing's insane! God! Can't wait to use this thing. I'll reforge it as well. Oh, man. Come on. Crit crit damage. 5-4. Okay. 5% crit damage. Come on. 5-9. Oh? Okay. Crit damage 4% though. Not that good to be honest. It is not that good for plus 9. Let's move on. Let's see what we get from this. 4, 7, 8. Oh! 6% crit damage. 4, 7, 14. Ah, lowest attack. I mean, attack and crit damage together is not, not too bad, but I think I might give up. Yeah. This necklace. This necklace, a lot of potential here. Let's see. 9 to 8. Come on. Oh, 4 speed. 4 speed, beautiful. 9, 6, 8. Come on. Oh, crit chance. 5%. Oh, let's go. 14, 6, 8. Oh. Oh, it's okay. It's like a 3, 4% attack depending on the base attack of the hero. 
Could be worse. I mean, everything's usable here. Let's see. The final roll. 14, 6, 8. It's definitely... I mean, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. It's usable. 14, 6, 8. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on. Oh my god. Oh, rip. It's still usable, but it feels bad. It feels bad. 6, 4, 4, 14. Oh, nice. 6, 7, 4, 14. Oh, yeah. Let's enhance it. All the way. All the way. 6, 7, 4, 21. Oh, my God. Uh, doesn't want to leave that crit damage alone. This is going to be a fighter Maya necklace or something like that. <laughs> 6, 7, 4, 28. Oh, can you imagine if it was some, like, crit chance instead? Uh, well, as I say that, right? Okay. Um, yeah, over 100 equipment conversions. Yo, just for the ring. Just for the ring. The 100 equipment conversions were worth. Yeah, definitely. Look at this beautiful ring. Oh. Feels good. This is like a perfect ring. The value on this, that's like uh, 5.1.6789. 8, this is a perfect ring. This is 10 points of value. Like everything is like, oh, beautiful. Oh. At the end of the day, even with the flat attack, this thing on a low base attack hero has a lot of value, right? This is. This is good. It's still good. Still usable. So, I'll just reforge it. Don't have too many materials, but uh, don't have too many good necklaces as well. Pretty solid weapon. No speed, but definitely can put it to good use. So, I'll do it. Nice. Oh, nice roll. If I could, you know, get the first one of the first three lines. Put that to get used. 32311. Oh, nice. With the reforge, it's gonna be pretty sweet. Too many materials, boys. God, look at these materials. Converted equipment, though. I uh, don't have too many of those left. Okay, so I got my uh, my helm here. That's a lot of damage out of the attack and crit damage. Pretty solid for a heroic piece right here. This is what I ended up with, the rolls on some of the gear that I enhanced, uh, you know, from equipment conversion or just gear laying around. Uh, I'm really happy with her stats. I wish I could drop the effectiveness, have more speed on her, but I'll be shuffling a bunch of gear around later down the line because I have that uh, free gear removal ticket saved up. So for the stats of the gear, uh, I mean... Yo, I got some pretty sweet upgrades today, and with the amount of crit chance that I'm getting from the weapon, from the chest, look at this thing, almost 30% crit chance. I was able to do, like, get a bunch of attack and crit damage from the other pieces. This rig is perfect. Like, th these are perfect rolls on this thing. What a beast. Couldn't believe it. Good lord. It's beautiful. And these boots have a lot of damage. But uh, yeah, I'll be trying her out in PvP. After this, it's going to be a showcase of bomb model uh, Kana in PvP. And then I'll be trying her out in uh, various PvE content in uh, separate videos. I can't wait to see what kind of numbers she can dish out. Can't wait to try her in all these places. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let us know how you've built your bomb model Kana. How does she perform for you? Do you have skill ups uh, with the kind of performance that you've been getting? Let us know about all this stuff in the comment section, but that's going to be it for this one, guys. Uh, if you're looking for an emulator to play Epic 7 or other mobile games, the one that I use personally, the one that I'm using right now, and it works well, uh, the link is in the description for it with the instruction on how to install it properly. But that's going to be it for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. I'm Astronauts. Good luck with all you do. Peace out for now.